Hello, this is Bryce Orlowski presenting my 112 term project, Maze Invaders. Maze Invaders is a 3D first person maze in which the player uh, tries to escape uh, the maze while not being trapped by the enemies. Enemies are depicted by these uh, colored spheres and, fortune and the, the enemies always know where you are and if they can, how to get to you and always pursue a path that goes directly towards you. Fortunately for you, you can actually move the walls to block the enemies or to help yourself get out. The only walls you cannot move are the walls in the boundary and those are depicted by a gray color so you know you can't move them. Also, there's a notification that uh, you can't move the borders if you attempt to. Settings for the player include a music volume and the field of view of the camera. Uh, so also, when you want to play, you can change the number of enemies, the enemy level, and uh, the maze length. For demonstration purposes, let's start with no enemies. You move around the maze using W, A, S, and D keys, W, A, S, and D keys, and you move the camera using your mouse. Uh, you select walls by clicking, and that'll highlight the wall that's directly centered in your screen. Uh, so if I come over here, it'll select that far wall. If I come over here, it selects the wall here centered on my screen. As I said earlier, you can move the walls, and you can do that using Q and E respectively. They were chosen because they are right above W, A, S, and D keys, so for convenience of the player. And it doesn't matter what direction you're facing, so if you faced uh, the a complete opposite direction, Q still rotates it left, E still rotates it right. Uh, this is for convenience of the player. You cannot run into moving walls. If you run into a moving wall, uh, it'll force you to go back away from the wall, and um, then it moves back to where you tried to rotate it from. Uh, so if you're in a rush and the enemy is coming after you, uh, you have to be careful you don't jump the gun and uh, run into the wall or you'll be doomed. Also you have to be careful not to block yourself in like this because you can't rotate walls into other walls. Uh, you'll have to forfeit. Let's see an enemy. So we put an enemy in the maze. It is the exact same thing except now um, and <laughs> enemies in the maze. So let's go try to find the enemy. So when the enemy comes, usually you don't try to find the enemy. Uh, the enemy usually finds you, but if we try to pursue the enemy, then oh, there it is. So that's what it looks like. It just comes through the maze and direct uh, on a direct path towards you. And if it collides with you, you lose. You can block it by moving walls in its path, uh, etc. This is my 112 turn project. I hope you enjoyed it.